Describe it. Brown, shiny, painful bite. Welcome to Watch Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 TV mistakes spotted by the fans. For this list, we'll be looking at the most notable mix-ups and flaws that eagle-eyed viewers caught while watching stories at home. What goofs have you spotted while binging your favorite shows? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. Plastic Prop – The Witcher Geralt of Rivia is a magically enhanced monster hunter tasked with protecting Crown Princess Ciri of Sintra. In order to keep his young charge safe, the Witcher needs to make use of his sword. It's an impressive weapon, most of the time. Fans noticed in one first season moment that the sword strapped to Geralt's back was not the usual metallic hilt and blade, but was instead a plastic prop version. Toss a coin to your witcher. The metal sword is probably pretty heavy, so it's understandable that he'd use a lighter one for distant shots. Most likely, they forgot to switch it out for the close-up. We can certainly imagine what Geralt would say about this mistake. Number 9. What's My Name? Supernatural since the Winchester brothers spend most of their time on the road hunting supernatural creatures, they have to introduce themselves quite a bit. That's my brother Dean. We are art dealers with Connors Limited. You're art dealers. That's right. So you'd think Jared Padalecki and Jensen Ackles would be solid on each other's character names. But the actors made a few slip-ups that made it past the editors. In the first season, Dean directs Sam's attention to an important ghostly detail while checking out a haunted painting. Sharp fans notice that Ackles starts to call Padalecki Jared by mistake. Sam, check it out. Resulting in the actor calling his on-screen brother something along the lines of Jam which Ackles himself confirmed at a supernatural convention. Where's the little girl? And the razor. <laughs> Number 8. Magic Pants – Gossip Girl As the It Girl of Manhattan, Serena Vanderwoodson was no stranger to media attention. But the scrutiny this gaffe received from fans was not a part of the plan for this teen drama. When Serena meets with Dan to try to keep her reputation intact, she should have paid more attention to her fashion choices. Upon arriving at the restaurant, she's seen wearing a peach dress, and her legs are clearly visible. Serena, wait a second, wait. But there is a noticeable change after that private chat. As Serena exits, the fashionista clearly has black sweatpants on under her dress. Hey, I just finished my errand. Yeah, I got everything I needed. It is common for actors to wear warmer clothes for close-up scenes. However, Serena seemingly added pants for no reason. Number 7. Signature Snafu – The Office Jim Halpert is no stranger to uncomfortable situations, but one situation threw actor John Krasinski for a loop. After Meredith is released from the hospital for a cracked pelvis, she asks Jim to sign her cast. Although it's an awkward location for a signature, the good-natured co-worker agrees. Jim uncomfortably takes up the pen and signs it with the wrong name. You can clearly see he writes John Krasinski by accident. This mistake was confirmed in the Office Ladies podcast during an interview with Kate Flannery. Flown by our private pilot, mm -hmm. eating our private meal, cooked yeah. by our private chef. Well, we never even have dinner now, so... She confirmed that since the first take was the best performance, they decided to use it despite the botched signature. You are going to learn to be more professional, Luke! Number 6. Unpainted Vision – WandaVision Vision has many different looks in Wanda's crazy created world. He frequently switches between a human illusion and his true self. Do that? I didn't mean to. Oh. Oh, darling. Oh. Hello, little fella. <laughs> As Wanda moves them through her favorite sitcoms, he also embraces the fashion of multiple decades. From the shoulders up, his android look is created with CGI. The rest of Paul Bettany's body was more commonly covered with clothes and makeup. This caused a minor mishap during the opener for their 1970s themed show, Now in Color. As Vision swings on a child's playset, the gap in his shirt cuff reveals human skin beneath. 
It's just a brief flash of humanity, but it stands out against the rest of his scarlet skin. What? Number 5. Stunt Drivers Not Fast Enough – One Tree Hill During its nine seasons, this drama series was no stranger to fast cars and dangerous driving. Although they put quite a few stunt drivers to good use, most of them didn't get any screen time. God, I love my life. That changed in one season four scene that centered on Chad Michael Murray and Paul Johansson. While riding in a flashy red convertible with his friend Dan, Lucas decides to test the car's speed when he's challenged to a street race. As they blast down the road, it's clear that the occupants are not Chad Michael Murray and Paul Johansson. Although it's clearly an editing mishap, it's nice to see that these skilled drivers got to have a brief moment in the sun. <laughs> Number 4. Green Screen Fingers – House of the Dragon In the new Game of Thrones prequel, King Viserys I Targaryen has to continually deal with his failing. During the second episode, he had to tend to a developing issue on his finger. Clearly, the live maggot remedy wasn't helpful because the fingers in question were amputated by the next episode. And uniting the two great Valyrian houses would certainly signal unity throughout the realm. Or were they? A Twitter user noticed that Paddy Considine, the actor playing the king, had two fingers taped with green tape during one scene. Damon yourself. At once, your grace. Masking the fingers in green would make it easier for the editors to remove inconvenient digits in post-production. Either it was a missed technical moment, or we're supposed to believe that it's maybe gang green? I do not seek to replace you, child. You've been much alone these last few years. Alone and angry. Number 3. Push the Call Button – The Flash Dating isn't easy for Barry Allen. As Central City's superhero, The Flash, he is constantly getting called away to solve the city's problem. Hey. Robbery at the convenience store on Brandon Pulse. His cell phone isn't only an issue in his dating life. It's also the reason for a fan-spotted mistake. Hello. Hey, I know you're on a date, but we got a jumper on 52nd and Wade. In the first season, new girlfriend Linda starts to suspect that his inattention is due to a lack of interest. She gives him a call to break off their relationship. As Barry holds the phone next to his face, we can see the green accept button on the screen. What are you talking about? You and Iris. Apparently, the flash is so fast, he can hold a conversation before he's even answered the call. Number 2. Forgotten Birthday – Stranger Things In season one of this Netflix scare fair, young Will's birthday was established as March 22nd. Do you know what March 22nd is? It's your birthday. In the latest season, his best friend Mike travels on that exact day to visit his girlfriend, Eleven. Will's there, too. While Elle is being humiliated by classmates at the skating rink, the date is displayed on a video camera. Despite it being Will's birthday, absolutely no mention is made of the event at any point. After having this fact pointed out by fans, creators Matt and Ross Duffer confessed that they had forgotten Will's birthday. Wow, if your creators forget your birthday, is that even worse than your friends and family? Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Gotta Have That Caffeine – Game of Thrones Many of the mistakes spotted in TV shows have been attributed to the ability to pause and see very brief moments that would normally not be noticed. However, this mistake was hard for fans to miss. While celebrating the fall of Winterfell, Tormund gives a speech in celebration of Jon Snow. As the camera pans across the room, we can see Daenerys Targaryen. And what is that next to her? An infamous and very recognizable white paper coffee cup with a lid. Strong enough to befriend an enemy and get murdered for it. 
Most people get bloody murdered. They stay that way. A long night of celebrating and speeches probably does require a caffeine hit. However, last we checked, they didn't have Starbucks in Westeros. It's only wine. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.